안녕! Hello everyone! This is Sunny. 안녕하세요! I hope everybody is doing well. Yes, let's learn. So, Wednesday, December 27th, lesson is a Korean alphabet, day 14. 14 is the last day of the consonant. Okay. So, 14 means it's a 14th consonant, which is H sound. It's called hit with vowel E. With E. He. He. Very good. Okay, so this is a uh, English is H sound with I sound equal H. He. Okay, I is a he. Okay, he. He. Okay, let's be circle in uh, vocabulary. You can put a he, okay? Number one, he. Everybody can bound you. Okay. Number two, he. Amanda, are you following me? Yeah, you know, I see some people need to write down he. So, with a he. So when you write he, consonant, look. One, two, three. Sometimes you can see, like, one, two, three. It is fine. Okay? So with a he, he. But this is correct way to write. Okay? So he. Number one. Z with O, Jo. Circle is in first position, no sound, only pronounce vowel. So, yo, this is a yo, vowel, vowel, yo, and then the other one was a o. So, yo with the ng, this is the ng sound with yong and he. Joyonghi means it's like a quietly, it's adverb, okay? Joyonghi. Joyonghi. Somebody's too noisy. You say Joyonghi. It's quiet, okay? Joyonghi. Number two. He with un. This n. H i n. Hin. Hin means uh, adjective. It's a uh, white. White. Hin nun. N with u. Ba u. Nu. N. Un, another N. So, N, U, N. Hin, Nun. Why snow? Nun means a snow. Also, it's a Nun. Nun. Yeah, I, it's a Nun too. Hin, Nun. Number three. He, with Square is in the third position. Um sound. So, he, with Um. Him. Him. Very good job. It's called him is it's gonna be power. Hey guys, very good. So number one, Jo Yong Hi. Number two, excuse me, Hin Nun. Number three, him. It's power. Okay. Let's write BTS. How do you say BTS in Korean? James? You're right. Pang Tang So Nyan Dan. Let's write. I need a Busa with a Ba and NG. And circle is in third position. Pang. And then E is Korean T. Remember E T. And A T with A Ta. And I need a Ng sound. Circle. Another circle in third position. Bang tang. So. With about O. So. S. Get so. So. Nya. Nu. With ya. Is nya. And un. In third position. Nyan. And then du. With a. Da. And third position. Tan. Bang tang. So. 
냠, 땀. Okay, guys. Very good. Time to the sing a song in Korean. Hangul. Can you say that? Hangul. Okay, guys. Very good. I'm looking for the media. Hangul. I'm looking for the chopstick. Yeah, I'm ready. So, in Korean, alphabet is called Hangul. Hangul. Uh, there are how many consonants in there? 14. Yeah, Valentine's Day. So, we did it good with a vowel E. Day 14 with one vowel. That's what I thought. Only one vowel. All day 14 was a vowel E. So, good with E, D. N with E, N. D with E, D. All the way day 14, last consonant is a sound with E. He. Very good. Okay, let's sing. Gini Didi. All the way he. Are you guys ready? Come on, guys. Cheer up. Aja. Okay, let's do it. One, two, three, go. Gini Didi. Me. One, two, three, go. Kini, diri, miri, si. Iji, chiki, ti, pi, hi. So please remember. H with a vertical line. Hi. If I say S with a vertical line, what is it? John. Si. Very good. Last question. If I say G with bow E. Kyler. Ki. Very good, you guys. Okay, so as we have done all the way we done bow, basic bow. Bow. So six bows is a basic bow. Okay. A. O. O. U. U. E. So we done. So today is I'm going to introduce a little bit is a uh, double vowel. It's gonna be ah with another line. It's gonna be ya, ya. Ah with another vowel. It's gonna be ya. Yeah, this is I say ya. Ah, ah is this I need e one more e. Okay. Excuse me. So this is. E O, ya O, and this is a ya, E O, okay. And this is O with another line. That's gonna be yo, like a yo yo. O with another bar, another line. It's gonna be you. It's like a falling down. You. <laughs> Here we go. And then this gonna be. Horizontal line, U, with a vertical line, E, U, E, U, E, E, remember that, okay guys, let's do maybe double consonant and then we are going to finish today, this is a G with a twin, G, G, sound, D, D, B, B, S, S, how about G? Everyone, good job, guys. Anyway, thanks for watching Sonny's channel. If you have any question, please ask me or I will answer for you. Okay, have a wonderful day. Stay warm, okay? Bye-bye, annyeong.